Well, hello everybody. This is Free Dot Laws No Prep Talk. Today we're going to talk about No Prep Kings, Washington, some massive failures, and an update after yesterday's race. Now, for the directly to the owners, please subscribe and comment and stay tuned for a lot more videos coming. All about the Free Dot Laws No Prep Kings race series and all the other Free Dot Law shows. So yesterday in the No Prep Kings return, we had a bunch of big failures including larry larson's pro charger explosion which this is pretty much the worst one that i've seen i mean it's no secret that pro chargers blow up especially when you overspend them they make a great product but they tell you don't overspend them and a lot of these guys are, are overspending them especially when the air is not good now I don't know if this is the case with Larry Larson. I don't want to say that he did overspin it, but there has been several racers on NPK that when the air is not good, they do overspin them, and that happens. I mean, that thing exploded. It even blew the front end apart. I mean, it destroyed a lot of stuff in Larry Larson's new car, and that really, really sucks, especially seeing the damage that it caused on a very beautiful car that's basically brand new so that was one of the failures giuseppe gentile broke the crankshaft before first round yesterday and there's been just a bunch of failures jim howe even though that he lost yesterday and he drew the lucky chip back in today he completely hurt the motor and he is currently rebuilding the motor to actually make first round today because he pedaled he lost a rocker arm and he pretty much did the motor he has four damaged pistons he recently said on facebook and they're working to get that car back together today nate sailor also had issues and he is rebuilding the engine to actually compete today and we also saw some spectacular shots like this one the massive save by sean ellington and i mean that man can drive and he's been driving on the street for a very very long time and as you may see that car got loose pointed straight to daddy dave and he definitely saved it and saved dave's ass as well so that's how good of a driver sean ellington is for sure so let's see what happens today as i've just said jim howe alex laughlin and daddy dave drew the lucky chip back in i know we don't like that because if you lose a race you shouldn't really get back in the show and this has actually happened to Giuseppe Gentile he got back in the race and he won the race so hey that's just the current situation with MPK now and no prep elite when they go to the 16 car field that will not happen so let's see what happens and it's gonna be a really good show today so I'll keep you guys updated and let's see who actually comes out on top today